Great to see you all again. Can we do something fun, Bucks? <laughs> mm hmm Yes, of course. Well, today we're going to learn all about the sun. Oh, the sun! Is the sun shining now? And does it keep shining behind the clouds? Well, shall we have a look? We're going to travel to space together in our very own rocket. Yeah! We're going into space! Let's see if you know what the sun looks like. Which one of these three pictures is the sun? Grrr, not the blue one. That doesn't look like the sun. <laughs> no, it's not the blue one. No, not the blue one. That's the planet Neptune. And the one with green and white spots. I don't think that's the sun either. It looks like a marble. Yeah, it looks like a marble. <laughs> That is Io. It's one of Jupiter's moons. <laughs> That's a funny moon. Then the middle one must be the sun. The one that looks very hot. Yes, you're right. That is the sun. <laughs> I thought so. It's our own star in the center of our solar system. A star? Huh? Is the sun a star? Yes, our sun is in fact a star. Just like the stars you see in the sky. Only they are so far away, we just see them as shiny dots. Our sun looks much bigger because we're much closer to it. And it's nice and warm. How does it get so warm, Box? The sun is made up of incredibly hot gases called hydrogen and helium. In the center of the sun, it's 15 million degrees Celsius. And it's about 15,000 degrees on its gassy surface. Whoa, that's hot! Luckily, Earth is not too close to the sun, so it just feels nice and warm for us. And we need that heat. If we didn't have the sun, Earth would be freezing cold. Everything would freeze. And it would get dark. Yes, completely dark. But luckily, the sun comes up every morning, doesn't it, Peppa? Yes. But where does the sun go when it goes down at night, Box? Let's have a look at that, shall we? Yes, I'd like to look. Long, long ago, people thought that the sun orbited around the Earth. But now we know that Earth orbits around the sun. The sun stays in place and it shines all the time. And the light from the sun shines on Earth, like a light on a tennis ball. If you are on the light side of the ball, then it is daytime. Ah, then it must be night on the dark side. Exactly. And the Earth rotates, which means you are not always in the light or in the dark side. It keeps turning towards the light and then to the dark. But the sun doesn't actually go away. So we just can't see it. Sometimes you can't see it during the day. Huh? When? When there's eclipse of the sun, a solar eclipse. It happens about twice a year. The moon comes in between the Earth and the sun and it blocks out the light. Sometimes just part of it and sometimes it's completely hidden. If there's a complete solar eclipse, it could get so dark that the birds stop singing and animals go quiet. 
They think it's nighttime. I'd love to see it. Yes. Though it only lasts a short time because the moon keeps going around and the sunlight quickly comes back again. Yes! Let's play a game! Yes! We can guess what it is! Let's see. Um... I see something pink. And... Blue? Yeah, some blue. Um, um, a bit more pink. And more pink. And blue. And, um... It's not the sun. Oh, yes! It's someone getting some sunscreen on for the sun. You're right. It's sunscreen. For going in the sun. Yes. If you're going out in the sun for some time, or if it's very hot, you have to put some sunscreen on. Look! She's got sunscreen on so she can go out in the sun. What does the sunscreen protect you from, Box? The sun is nice and warm but it also has some harmful ultraviolet rays. They can burn your skin, so it's important to protect yourself against them. But I love it when the sun is shining outside. Yes, of course. Sunlight is also good for us. As long as you cover up, put on sunscreen and don't spend too long in the sun. Okay. The sun is extremely hot, and it's also extremely big. Shall we have a look at the size of the sun compared to Earth? Is the sun half the size of Earth? Is it two times as big as Earth? Or is the sun a hundred times the size of Earth? A hundred times? That's enormous! It can't be that big. <laughs> oh, yes it can. It's hard to imagine, but it's true. The sun is a hundred times the size of Earth. If Earth was the size of a tiny sugar crystal, the sun would be the size of a football. So you see, it's much bigger. Wow! I'm pleased we have such a good sun, Box. <laughs> On Earth, we are very thankful for the sun. It makes Earth warm and light. Yes, warm and light. The sun's heat makes liquid water and oceans. Many animals and plants are able to live there. Ooh, look, fish. Yes, lots of fish. There are also seals in the sea and sharks and seaweed. The heat from the sun makes water evaporate and become clouds. And rain falls from the clouds. And rain makes plants grow. Exactly. Plants drink up rainwater, but they also need sunlight to be able to grow. Thanks to the sun, a tiny seed can become a large plant or a tree with leaves and blossom and fruits. And flowers. Yes, thanks to the sun, we have flowers too and grass, and tomatoes, and rivers, and monkeys, and birds! <laughs> oh yes, birds too! And dogs, and cats, and four-leafed clovers, and tangerines, and great big trees, and... <laughs> Shall we go back to Earth then? Yes. But we'll come back to space soon, won't we, Box? Yes, of course. We'll come back again soon. Bye -bye. Goodbye. Bye, space. See you soon. Fly, 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 fly. High, 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 high in the sky. High in the sky. That was great fun. Did you like it too, Peppa? Yes! That was a great journey through space. And do you remember all the things you learned? Uh, ooh. 
The sun is a star, like all the other stars in the sky. It's made from different gases and it's very, very hot. They used to think that the sun orbited around Earth. But they were wrong about that because Earth orbits around the sun. It is light and warm on Earth thanks to the sun. And that's why lots of plants and animals can live here. Woohoo! Well, wasn't that a great journey? Yes, and next time we'll go there or there or there. <laughs> yes. Goodbye, everyone. We'll see you all next time. Goodbye. Bye, Toby. Bye, Pepper. Bye, Box the Bear.